how's everything been, bro? What have you been up to? Uh, I've just been training, uh, just, just been training hard, uh, keeping, my, keeping my weight down. Yeah, just uh, excited and happy to be active again and fighting. Got you. Um, you you're fighting um, February, is it 10th, right? Yeah, February 10th. Okay, what do you, you know anything about your opponent? Um, he's, he's 17 and 3. 15 knockouts, so he has more knockouts and the three fights he lost, he got knocked out. So he's only, he's like a do or die type fighter. He's like he either win by knockout or he's gonna get knocked out. Got you. Where has a uh, training camp been for you? Oh, uh, my training camp has been out of Riverside. Okay. Are are you training out of um what what gym are you training out of? Uh, this kid's it's just a private boxing gym. Okay. Are you working? Um, who who are you uh, training with these days? Oh, my dad's my trainer. Got you. And he's been your trainer for a long time, right? Yeah, he always trained me. We just had, a, we were always like a, you with RGBA and stuff like that. They were always uh, with us, but my dad was always training. Okay. And he was training me too. Okay, good deal. Now, um, how does it feel to be back with uh, Top Rank? Um, you know, you you were, you were kind of left them for a little bit, went with Mayweather Promotions, but now you're back. Uh, tell me what that's like. Um, well... I feel more comfortable with uh, with top rank just because they built me since the beginning, so they kind of know how I work and they know like uh, we have good chemistry, like we work real well together. So, so I'm comfortable with them. I, I like working with them, and, and I'm happy to be with them. Okay, um, what weight class are you gonna be competing at uh, for, from now on? What 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 are you looking at? I'm gonna get. I'm gonna. Fight, I'm gonna look for to get a touch shot with thirty. Uh, this fight I'm gonna fight at. This fight I'm gonna fight at 132. Uh, just working my way down. Uh, and then hopefully the next one 31. And then uh, hopefully for something for some type of title or something like that. Uh, go go to 30 NBF NBO or whatever for eliminate or whatever it is. Uh, uh, make 130 and then for a title for court 130. You know, everybody near 130, 135, they always talk about Lomachenko. Is that even though he's at 135, you mentioned he might go back down to 130 one day. I mean. What do you think of Lomachenko in a possible fight with him? I think he's a great fighter. Uh, he's very skilled, of course. He has a great amateur background, and he's an Olympian, something like that. He's a great, he's a great fighter. Uh, I believe he's getting a little older. He, he might be like right down. He took, he took uh, quite some punishment in his last fight. He had like bruised eyes, stuff like that. But I mean, in the future, if that's a fight that could be made, then why not? Okay. Um, how do you? How do you think is the best way to fight somebody like Lomachenko? Um, just n not try to be so uh, like don't, don't you can't be looking out looking for a knockout punch. You have to like uh, throw more punches and be more like versatile and, and relax and, and, and like try to be quick with your feet because um, I mean he, he's just a he's a he's a good defensive fighter.